Oh my word. All feckin' righty. Shitey tighty. How the feckity shite are we, guys? What's the crack? You got your lefty Lucy's ready to eat. And your righty tighties. Guys, my face is on fire. Just had the spiciest not real pizza ever. Oh my god. What the fuck? Oh my word. Guys, how are we? How are we? We have a, oh my word, we have a prediction today that requires extra chatter, doesn't it? As some of you were listening yesterday when I said, <laughs> and I quote, past during yesterday said, those of you who were here last Tuesday know that today I needed to get my fucking beard trimmed because I had a meeting today, blah, blah, blah. And then after that, I said, Actually, no, that was tomorrow. And I think somebody caught on to that and went fucking, went in big today. So fair fucking play to you. Listen, when you guys are paying attention and, uh, you know, you deserve to be rewarded. You deserve to be rewarded with a huge, huge bank of doubloonage. 21,000. Oh my word. That is just nuts. A nuts amount. To go to the, um, to go to the, uh, believers today. Incredible. Great work. All right, guys. Today, I got my, my beard trimmed. And I also got a wee, a wee bit of a haircut. I know the, the thing wasn't for that. But, um, we did actually need to get a haircut today. And I got a trim going at the same time. So, no, I didn't. I didn't. Why the fuck would I? It's, listen, it is a Wednesday you know that on Wednesdays is basically like a second Sunday for me. It's another day off, all right? I don't do jack shit midweek, all right? Mid-fucking-week. Halfway. Why in the fuck would anybody ever trim their beard on a Wednesday? Are you mad? Are you cray-cray? Are you cray-cray, tay-tay? Are you nuts? For fuck's sake. Not a fucking hope of an evening would I ever in my right mind. Listen, I didn't get a haircut either. That was a trick question. Who the fuck gets their haircut A on a Tuesday, A on a, a Wednesday, and B on a haircut as well? Not gonna happen. It was a test and ye all failed, excluding but not limited to whoever voted on nay today. Guys, great fucking, good, good to fucking see you. Hope your Wednesdays Bruh. are going great. It's the hump day today. I always thought that humping was, you know, the, you know, um, but it's not, it's not. It, they call it the hump day because it's, because it's the day that you do the, um, there was some bridge or something built that day. Mad, isn't it? Great to fucking see you. Guys. Oh, we're listening to some YAG music as well. Guys, Kilted was first today. Fair play to you, Kilted. Probably, because this is a recording. I'm kidding. It wasn't a recording. It wasn't a recording. I did indeed not get my beard trimmed today. Look at it. Look. Grey. I'm halfway to a Jotson. Look. Halfway. I'll get there someday. Um, right, what are we doing? Don't do that. It's preferring putting true, 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 Kilted. I would never in my, I would never in a million years. I would never in a million years. Guys, congrats to all who voted no today. No, there you go. All right, that's a share of 21,000. Who was the 21,000? I don't like this now because I can't see. I can't see who voted on the I anymore. I used to be able to check, kind of, but only one person. Um, Sigma, good to see you. How are you keeping? Belint, how are you? Duke of Soft, how's it going? K Tactics, how are you doing? Canny, it is indeed showtime. I hope you're very fucking nervous, Canny. I'm gonna rip your feckin' shite apart. 
Oh my word, if you've seen yesterday's stream and the tr stream before, you you don't know what the fuck's coming. Your fucking game is about to be torn asunder, all right? <laughs> um, but it's not first, is it? It's second, I think. So you're going to have to just sit on that and stew now for another wee while. Um, <laughs> how are you doing, Tactics? Good to see you. Welcome in, Hans all. How are you? Um, S is nice, Shadow. How you doing, Brian? Good to see you. Hugan, how you doing? I mean, feeling well. I feel better, uh, Hugan. You know where we are. If you want to ever um, reach out on the DMs, you know our DMs are always open. Um, Astronomy Show, how you doing? Twenty k on I today's the day. Was it you killed it? Was it you that did it now with your fifty million billion deplutons? Ah, huh? plundering asunder you are. Astronomy Show, how the feck are you? I almost called you Simon there the other day. You're not Simon, are you? You're no, you are Simon. Are you Simon? Simon or Peter? Simon. Simon, isn't it? Isn't it Simon? Is it Simon? It's probably not Simon. I probably think it looks somebody completely fucking different and it's most embarrassing shite I could possibly be doing. But yeah, there you go. Um, Brian, good on you. You won <laughs> on a Wednesday. Fair fucking play to you now. Danny with the extra curse and well, fuck it. Fucking shite anyway, Danny, for fuck's sake. Fuck bollocks arse. Shite. Shite. Shite bollocks. Um, arse. Um, look, 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 look. <laughs> we always tickle Bardy, don't we, whenever we're doing the thing. Today is, is Bardy, Bardy t-shirt day, because, listen, all my other t-shirts, I haven't put on a wash in a while, like a week minimum. Anyway, listen. Mm. I should be wearing my red hat, shouldn't I? Because Bardy. Marty would do that as well, wouldn't he, of an evening? How the fucking shite are you doing, Danny, anyway? Um, on a Wednesday, true, true. Um, kill to that astronomy show, you put photos on the eye today. Uh, Desert Tiger, how the feck are you? That is indeed a weenus and a half. Um, could be dangerous yet. Uh, Climax there was so strong. Thank you, thank you very much. Um, it's one thing now that I'm proud of. Thank you, Brian. Um, <laughs> how you doing, Fresh? You good to see ya? Um, bruh, indeed, Desert Tiger, true, 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 I wasn't here not to say, true, 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 um, so Canada, well, fuck's sake, you can feel better, buddy, feel fucking better, how could you possibly, like, you're here now, you're here now, be in the moment, um, I almost, 9k, good on ya, good on ya now, good thing I didn't lay out too much, good, yeah, good, 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 good stuff, freshy. Um, I would like to withdraw after that. Well, you know what? It's up to you now. Hands on, how are you doing? Welcome in. Um, what a beautiful human. No, you actually, Thindle. How the fuck are you, Hugh? Thindle? Human of the year, Sweden, 2022 to 2023 for three years running. Yeah, of an evening. Um, drop 20k on I only got 450. Fuck off. You do not have half a million almost. No fucking way, Kilted. What the fuck? You're gonna trade it in for a VIP badge at this point. You you can, you know, if you like. Um, I could print screen the stream and set it up my desktop. True, true. Then you'd never be late for a stream ever. And uh, my name is Jason. 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 Of course it is. Simon. Who the fuck is Simon? It wasn't. I don't know any Simons. I know one Simo. I don't know any Simons. Fuck's sake, it is Jason. I, I remember, I, I was like, aha, I'm gonna remember this now. Because I read it underneath your stream one of the evenings. I refuse to spend the response because uh, Unity Discussions. True, Tyndall, true. I am a social strategy minutes ago, true. <laughs> Hanging in there, thanks, how are you? I'm doing well. Thank you very, very much, Tyndall of the evening. Uh, all good here now. Good stuff, J Freshy, for fuck's sake. Good fucking feck shite of an evening. Guys. We have a lineup today, let me tell you. We have some... Right, so the way I chose the games to play, right, was completely random. So today, we actually have quite a few regulars um, in the play schedule, right? Wait. Ah, bollocks. I was... No, wait. No, it's Wednesday. It's Wednesday. Stop it. Stop it. <laughs> I played those other ones. Right, so today we have... Wait, I didn't download those, did I? I might have fucked up. Hang on. Oh, jeez. We might have to swap days, guys. Oh, fuck. I fucked up. I thought it was Thursday today, and I downloaded all the Thursday games. 
And there's two Unreal games in here, man. I'm not going to be able to download an Unreal game and stream at the same time. Oh, uh, fuck. Oh, no. <laughs> As if I would ever in my life be that particularly in 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 particular be that messing. <laughs> <laughs> no, I had to free up fucking space for this one. Free up fucking space for fuck's sake. What is with your three fucking million billion gigabyte fucking projects, guys? Hmm? Have an A? Hmm? <laughs> no. Have you, have you, are you a participant, Tenzal? I haven't met you before, I don't think. Imagine such a troll. True. Can we list in the W2E can prep to what? What are you talking about? What? Ours is like 700 megabyte, easy peasy. What are you talking about, Tindall? You are messing. You know I'm messing. Trolling runs hard today. Thank you. Thank you. I've been here too long to follow lies. I don't understand. It's um, I'm changing my name to JavaScript object notation. That would be that would be a t proper bastard thing to do, um, Jason. Because, listen, we have a... Jason command here, which goes to show how we feel about that particular bastard. And Streamlabs isn't modded anymore. Streamlabs, buddy. There you go. All right, guys, let's get started. Let us get, let us get started. We have Battle Fjordge up first. Battle Fjordge, guys. Something that will stretch the limits of my particular com computer in particular. Um, how you doing? Oh fuck, uh, uh, Brian! Thank you so much for the uh, for the gifts up to hands all. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, guys, we have Battle Feck and Forge, one from Essence Night Shadow, who is not only a participant but also a oh shit, hang on, oh, I'm just getting a blank screen here. Yeah, it's not working. Fuck. Okay, we'll come back to this later. Hopefully, it'll work then. I don't know what's wrong with this. Have you ever seen this before? This is weird. Ah. Yeah, it's just not going to work, is it? Ah. Ah, it crashed. It crashed. Crashed there now, yeah. Okay, we've got music. And we have to make sure that everything is in the right spots. Is it in the right spots? Because I had some shite open earlier. Yes, we're good. We're good. So this is made in Unity. I thought this was made in... Um, I thought this was made in um, Unreal there earlier on. Right, here we go. Dev screen. Ta-da, guys. Look, it is indeed not. Not fucked and crashing. It's not. Guys, we have a settings menu. Should we check out the settings menu? Make sure it's not bullshit. There we go. Monitor zero. Is that my monitor zero? Interesting. Good stuff, great stuff. Okay. It probably works. Let's say it will. Credits, Brian, Manny, Hans, and Razvan. Good shit, good shit. Good fucking shit. Well, first impressions now. Jern Jam 2 winner in the window over here. That's some of your subliminals, right? That, that's minus marks. Minus marks for that now. <laughs> Dude, your face b bellies. What, what the fuck is bellies? Thanks for shouting out Streamlabs. Did I? What is wrong with me today? Mod. Streamlabs. There we go. I fucking, fucking did the fucking wrong thing, didn't I? Of an evening. Right, guys. The music only starts up. Wait, does the light as well? No, never mind. I was going to give you extra marks for that, but these nullify them anyway. So we've got some We've got some baddies. We have Battle Fortridge. Oh. Holy shit. Is this Sinti stuff? Jeez, he looks really good, this lad. How's it going? What's the bird? Good. Oh. What the fuck? Okay, the controller feels nice. Press S, F to customize your Mac. You just copied what I was doing. You just copied what I was doing. And for fuck's sake, you just you just hacked my GitHub. Oh. Oh, more stuff. Box of shit. Tell me we can walk around outside as well. Dude, what the fuck? Ooh, we're standing in the radioactive waste and it's not killing us. Minus marks. 
Oh. Let me in, please. It's gotta be Sinti, right? I, I recognize the panel. Jesus, looks really nice. Really good. Did you do some trick with the camera field of view? I feel like you did. I'm gonna say it now that you did. You did now, yeah. Oh, we have a collectible over here. Ah, oh, not collectible. Minus marks. Whilst Jern dot playing game score minus minus. And uh, yeah, there you go. Cyber City, is it? It looks fucking gorgeous. Really, really nice. I like the music. Oh, we've got a DeLorean. It hmm? uh, looks like the 85 uh, variant. Yeah, yeah, probably twin cam. Uh, 450 horsepower, brake horsepower, sorry. Ah, oh, how many horses on that particular? Ah, oh, yeah, probably like 15, 16 horses, yeah. I... Listen, I know about... I know about car stuff, guys, come on. I want to see what I what I can do before I go to what I know I can do. You know what I mean? Oh, this guy wants to chat. You creepy-looking bastard. Mission 1, bot scrappy, difficulty easy. Okay, let's do that one, please. And then... Go to the fight, but I should go here first, surely. Okay, I tried that already. So I unlock stuff. So that's the assembly I get. Ooh. Just have to go to the flight. Okay, that's it. Okay, all right. Awesome, awesome. Yeah, it's very, very nice looking. Let's do it! Oh! A tutorial! Q and E! Rotates. Move. Punch left and right. Combo. Combos both of them together. Good. Good. Looks... Seems simple enough. <laughs> okay, this is kinda cool. Yeah. Listen, I'm just a natural, born natural for this shit. Shark, how you doing? And Park, how you doing? Have I missed anything now of an evening? Been looking forward to seeing those results. Yeah, buddy. Yeah. Oh, we got stuff. What did that do? Did I get new guns or something? Erend, how you doing? How'd I get so good at this game? Is it here and I mean, uh, <laughs> you know, um, if you like, <laughs> you know, awesome. <laughs> How you doing, Erend? Guys, if you don't know, Erend, get the fuck follow shite. Makes games uh, basically in, in Godot. So. How you doing, James? How you keeping? Good to see ya. Erend, for fuck's sake. Aaron, Aaron still hasn't... Aaron does music, but he doesn't give us any. What did it change about my mech? I like how clunky it feels. Hiya! 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 Fucking eh. Go on, right in the bollock. That last one there was a proper, like, drop to the knee and fucking switch, switcheroo. Used to be boxer, right? So I know all of these moves. That he's doing there. See where he's coming. Brian's probably a boxer as well at some point in his life there. Yeah, yeah, probably. All right, what are you doing? Near pa knee pads. A bedled. Did it change anything though? Did it change? I don't think, I don't see any differences. I, d I feel like it's not changing anything. Is that, is that supposed to ha uh, Is this supposed to be happening? Okay, that was the second one. This one's difficulty med. <laughs> we'll see just how difficulty med it is. Oh, jeez. He looks he looks slightly more scary, doesn't he? Get fucking shit on, noob. Fucking... I've been... I've been shitting on noobs like that ever since I got an Xbox. Psst.
than before the watch and hard to choose not yet. True. Reminds me very much of the autonomous robot wars with their little robot dudes and the rest of the ring. Yeah, true. Uh, maybe one day I will. The thing I've actually produced in years is a wee little track for my game track trailer. trailer, trailer, trailer. What are you talking about, Erin? Erin, are you okay? Do we need to call somebody? Okay, I, I want to see what this does, right? It's not changing something in the background. It's not. Prove it to me. Oh, wait, no, something this did flicker there. Ah, it did. It put on shin pads. Or, or shoulder pads. Hope he's wearing his shin pads is what they used to always say. All right, Zeus. Let's do the fucking... Let's do it. Very, very beautiful looking game. And the way it sounds and the transitions between the scenes is really good. Oh, this guy looks like a bit of a beast. All right. Come at me, bro. Fucking... Eh. Eh. Yeah. Get yeah, fucking shit on. Noob. Fucking noobed on. He didn't even touch me. Difficulty hard. My first game I got double KO'd. Yeah, same. Eh. Ooh, missiles. The missile knows where it is at all times, you know. Because it knows where it isn't. It does that by subtracting where it was from where it isn't. It now is. Yeah. How do I fire the missiles? Don't tell me I can't fuck... You fucking, you fucking well tell me I can't fire the missiles. Then I will fucking, I will be, I will be marking you out. And not really, but for the meme. Can I do anything else? Is this it? Is this it now? Yeah, I think I feel like I've I've won the game. Hello, X Gordon. How you doing? Great streamer there. How much damage does he do when he hits us? Oh, quite a bit actually. I couldn't fire the missiles. Unfucking believable. Very, very cool. Really nice game. Love the controller. Animations are fluid. It's definitely done in like at least URP. Jeez, it looks really good. Like beautiful mech wars. Wrecker versus Tie for end. Love it. A cat. A cat uses this workstation. Bring your dog to work day, and then you have to put the cat's paw on that, and then it opens up. What a great looking scene. It's amazing, yeah. Really, really nice. Very, very cool robot thing. And, uh, yeah, it just goes to show how, how good you can get, like, stylized stuff to look. Like, the emission from the textures as well is um, flawless, honestly. Really, really nice. Is it Erp? Erp. I you just finished. Excellent text coding. Good on ya. For real, what a real... Yep, true. So cool, yeah, yeah. Guys, do y'all know Um, Super shiny, yeah. Want to expand further on it? Yeah, yeah. Ex especially with the missiles. Night Shadow. I feel like you need to look at the prefabulated amulite. I'm bringing in a prefabulated amulite. Um... Upgrades. I think prefabulation, right, and amulites, and then the missiles, okay, and then just put in a guidance system um, with a base plate, of course. Um, what? These are Sinti. Uh, Cyber City, Sci Fi, and Apocalypse. Very, very cool, hands all. Don't forget to mitigate the side fumbling. Well, it will be effectively prevented, yeah. So, so we've won now, yeah? Fucking deadly. Really like it. 24 hour Wi Fi. Hang on a minute. Hotel, motel, Holiday Inn, DeLorean. Two DeLoreans. One towed the other one, it seems. Oh, I can go in and have a look around. It gives me mad Kingpin vibes. You ever played Kingpin back in the day? Like out here, where it's very dark, you know? I like the way Earp does the darkness. Can we can we light stuff up with our face? We can. Look at that. And that's just gorgeous. Look. Unreal eat your heart out with your Fortnite garbage. Look at that. Hmm? Oh, stairway. Your controller is very, very good. Is this the what what controller is this, if you don't mind me asking? I'm gonna say a kinematic character controller. 
or something custom. Want to do more? Of course, yeah, yeah. But that's the joy of the fucking jam, man. It lights a fucking fire under you. I'm sure you've learned an awful lot as well. I think everybody who has competed in these jams always learns an absolute fuck ton. And that's why it's such a pleasure to, to put them on. Um, but yeah, very, very nice. Look at them. Those are some background houses. We're going exploring. Ah, <laughs> ah, ah! <laughs> it was doing the um the level design. I have a bone to pick. <laughs> like a market, yeah. All the music was handmade. Animations was hand done. Animations? Really? Do you have like a fucking mocap suit? They they look really realistic, like. Fuck, who do I commission for the fucking animations? Hang on a minute. Very nice character controller. Love it. The music's brilliant as well, yeah. Let's go into the battle scene again, actually. The only thing that was pre-made was the models. Gotcha. Character controller was handmade. Oh, my word. Hands all and myself. Very, very nice. Send you how it's done. That's, that's all right. Sure, I'm only, sure, I'm only messing half the time. Now let's go in here. I don't, don't want to kick his ass anymore. I used an F-Mod for the music. I did an F-Mod thing yesterday. Yeah, the music's really good. Very, very nice. No, I'm not what? Yeah. Great stuff. Excellent work. I want to use that gun, though. See that gun up there? I want to, like, fuck with everything in the level. That's, like... That's a really nice, um... Thing with, like, a game like Borderlands, right? You go over to one of these, and you press F on it. And all of a sudden, it pops open, and some loot comes out. I love that kind of shit. Jeez, they've... They've really given you everything, like, in the, uh... In what you call it. Oh! Darth Maul scene. Bit of Darth Maulage. That's cool. Oh man, that's so cool. Very nice. Great work, guys. Excellent. Um, a menu as well would be cool, but no Z fighting anywhere. Mm-hmm. Let's see about that. <laughs> All right, Kilton. See you later, buddy. And uh, I using F mod. Gotcha, gotcha. Very nice. I did. I did a little bit of uh, F mod stuff yesterday, like just a, a what you call it, a tutorial on it. Um, very very cool. All right, that was Battle Forge, guys. I implore you to go try it out yourself. Do some rating. I've noticed that there's a few people that haven't done any fucking ratings, but that's okay. All right, Clockwork Life is next, Kenny. Clockwork Life. Clockwork Life, which is playing browser. Brilliant. Clockwork Life's itch page. Let's load her up. Is there music? Is there sound? I think there is, right? Ah. This is the, this is the screenshot from... From the... From the page. Oh, we do have music. Spam robots to survive. You need to lot to stay alive long enough. Uh, research is the next turn. Technically a bug, but it makes the game a first. Aha, uh -huh, gotcha. Um, was it camera movement? Wait. Research stuff stays available for the next run. Okay, so it's like a roguelite. Camera movement was it. Left mouse, choose units to command. Oh, what's an RTS? Um, mouse wheel zooms out. See resources better. Stacking bots on one field damages them. Bots attacking in range. No need to send them directly to the target robot field. Okay. No issues. The bots aren't responsive. After selecting them, you can send them somewhere. They need to ramp up. Phase to start moving. Missing indicator. Okay. Uh, mine coal and scraps. Stay... Good stuff. Good dough game again. You're in. Your influence. Knows no bounds, errant. Okay. 
Accidentally roguelite, love it. Is the music okay, guys? Can you hear it all right? If I bring it up a bit. I think it was at around here yesterday. Is that okay? Good? Yeah, the artwork, straight away, artwork looks really, really nice. Nice drawing. What's that say? Rel. Rel. Hitch. Hmm. Sound credits is Sammy. Excellent. Yeah, Sammy joined two fucking teams, but this is this sounds good, yeah. <laughs> okay. Play. Here we go. Clockwork Live of an evening. Oh, my word. Holy shit. Okay, we need to... Whoa, what the fuck? It's a baddie. Bollocks, we're fucked. Base. Build robot. Available parts. Can we play a prescription? Spatula. Okay. Build, build a few of them. Oh! How do I, how do I move them? Aha! Uh -huh. Spacebar. What? Why is he dying? Huh? I don't get it. It's unresponsible. No click, you stacked robots. Okay, so we're not allowed to do that. Stop moving so much. Okay, we're not allowed to stack them, okay. Okay, space bar. You had it just a couple of seconds ago. <laughs> you don't know. <laughs> maybe, maybe I think sometimes you hear what you want to hear, Kenny. So they need, they need something, but what is it? So last week, yeah, same. Okay. Research. Do, have I, have I fucked myself now by building four of these things? I feel like I have. Okay, they move, but after a few seconds. Okay, I need to, I need to restart. Hang on, hang on. I have an idea. I have an idea. I need a factory. All right. Can I stop telling me how to play? All right. You don't know. You don't know either. All right. <laughs> no, I need, I need all the help in the world. Oh, okay, cool. I thought we had a bug there, but we don't. All right. Go kill that fecker. There we go. Build robot. No, we don't want to build a robot. We want to build a, a factory right there. No, we don't. Do we not want to build a factory? Research. More HP and still cheap. Do the thing. Ah, oh, my robot got killed. Can I put like two in? Build. Build two. Now nah, we're sucking diesel. It looks really good, yeah. <coughs> okay. Good. Okay. Good, 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 good. This guy. Grab some of that stuff. Please. Oh, he is doing it. Okay. So the robots actually do all the work for you. He's not doing anything. There's another one. Scrap. Should I just build like 10 of them? So the research doesn't work for the current, right? It only works for the later ones. You can feck off over there. I like the the fog of war is nice as well. 
Okay, we're building shit tons of them. Okay. We have to kill this fucker. How many can it actually support? I feel like I'm getting a lot of units. And how far can they shoot away? Give me a nice wee indicator. Oh, it shows you. It is an indicator. Nice. Very cool, man. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I knew that. It's getting kind of challenging now with all the baddies. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. So I can only build four at a time. I got it now. Oh, I can build factories now. Cool. Okay, I might I might actually love this game. Okay, fuck that guy up. We're lying about the loud noises. <laughs> I need to upgrade them, I think. Yeah, I need to upgrade my robots. It's taking so long to get resources now, no? Oh, jeez, Rick. It's already one of my favorites. Why am I losing scrap? Am I losing scrap? I feel like I'm losing scrap. Damn it. What's this? Iron. Copper, okay. Ah, oh, I need a copper factory as well. Have I lost? I feel like I've lost. Somehow. What's this? This is the scrap, right? And this is what? Coal. Okay. Thank you for all of those cursors. Fortuitous. How are you doing? I can't do any research. I probably need copper for the research or something. More robots. How much is it per robot? I don't see the cost. Seems like it's like eight or nine. I feel like I'm losing, like badly. Iron converter cons converts scrap to iron. There's no tool tip for it. Iron converter. No, I got away from my infrastructure. You bastards. I need a copper factory. I don't see an iron converter anywhere. I feel like I'm just overrun. Iron factory. 
Iron converter. Huh? Internal, they're called converters. Aha, uh -huh, sorry, gotcha, okay. Ah, so these are ruining it. Uh huh. What the fuck happened there? Build the fucking thing. Okay, I need to restart. I know what I'm doing now. Probably. Can I do any research before I leave? I suppose I need this stuff, right? The copper. Okay. Alright. We're going again. We're going one more. Uh, Sammy, how you doing? <laughs> Jesus, Sammy. <laughs> nice game. Isn't it cool? I like this one. This is definitely, yeah, one of my, one of my favorites now. Right. Let's go again. Is there settings for, no. There's no setting for, um, journey mode. Just, just putting it out there. <laughs> Kidding. All right, let's full screen. And let's build our basic fella. As many as we can. Can't see. I can't see where he's going. Let's kill this fella first, right? Or no, we should we should we should get some stuff first, right? And deselecting as well would be nice. Lost a bot from that. Get over there. More robots. What is it? Ten per? Nah. No, eleven per. Is it? Oh, it says it underneath. Gotcha. The red number underneath. Gotcha, gotcha. I guess I should go kill him. More robots. Six now. But I wasn't able to build it. I feel like that space has glitched out or something. No, don't stack. Yeah, there's something on that spot. I'm going to restart, okay? I think that was a bug. Because if I put something there now, I wasn't able to build more than more than three. And if I put something here, it starts to die. Doesn't he? Go back to fuck. Yeah, I think that's bugged out, right? Okay, cool. All right, we know what we're doing now. We know what we're doing, all right? It sounds good as well, Sammy. I'm gonna actually just put those two there. Put this one here. I'm the wave button. True. All right, let's save up for some factories. Prices show up when you select it. Uh huh. 60, okay. Oh, this is, this is moving the camera and the selection. 60 for that too, okay. We're good for now. Where do they come from? Do they spawn from the edges of the map? Is there a way like I can choke point? Whoa. 
Ooh. It's taking from... I have to spam so that it doesn't take it too quickly. Uh, there. And... Any more scrap along here? Cold. Oh. We need to defend a little bit. Fucker. Do the enemies turn into scrap? Cool. Very, very nice. First Godot game. Oh my word. I was playing some uh, Company Heroes with one of my mates recently. And I was trying um, Sudden Strike 4. And this kind of has that kind of vibe about it. Very, very cool. Can I do some research now? Aha, okay, sorry. We can, but we need time. As long as we're mining the first stuff, everything else just kind of takes care of itself, right? I'm stacking them an awful lot by accident. I have two for two now, yeah. Okay, research. Cool. Oh shit, we have new enemies. So I should be able to build this now. Oh, I can. Cool. That looks slightly different. Dwarven weapon, 200. I'm fucked. We have seven. So what's the um What's the trick to it? Like how do you how do you win? Just get good. Fuck, I keep doing that. We have eight. Okay, we just stall, right? We just stall and we're fine. Ooh, military movement. Very cool.
Fuck. This factory's kicking my ass. Let's get rid of both of them, right? So many. Hey, Manatano, how are you doing? No, don't kill my copper factory. Can eat this game ticks so many boxes of mine it's so good is there any more upgrades I can get no. they persist though right so next game I would have more stuff right fuck <laughs> it's so difficult man we have 11. I have enough. Ah, there's no spot. Fuck, I'm out of coal. We have 11. I think that's a pretty good score. Kai didn't give me a better rattles. Uh-huh. I'm just as long as first possible highest wave. My son was on 15 first run. Oh, my word. Every consecutive run, it gets easier. Gotcha. There's no one true. Ah, <laughs> Mm. Is it because it's blocked? Yeah. More music. Oh, man. That was fucking deadly. All right, 12 waves. I think that's... That's decent. <laughs> um... Yeah, GG. That's fucking deadly, Kenny. Absolutely class. Are you going to keep it up? 15 waves. Jeepers fuck. Really, really difficult. But very, very, very cool. I might leave this up because we might play it again later. <laughs> All right, let's, uh, let's get to the next one. Um, the next one is called Petrol by Mills and Manadano. Let's check this out. I think there's a bit of music in here from Sammy also. Okay, this is our first Unreal game. I think. Yeah, here we go. It's booting up. It's got networking. That's not. Uh, right, so. The menu is quite nice. Is it working? Got a new game and a continue? Load game? Really? Jeepers. All right. What the fuck? I feel like I just loaded into a... Oh my god. What's this thing on the right? Oh. It looks gorgeous. Car's a bit jank, but it looks fucking really, really nice. It seems to be bonking on stuff. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it has. 
Okay, my computer, I think, is struggling with this one. Holy fuck. The car... <laughs> is the car turning? There we go. Turn the graphics down. Options, there we go. Video... Is it is it lagging for you guys? Okay, on the on the flat ground it seems okay. Yeah, it is lagging. Is it dropping frames? No. I don't think it's dropping frames. Yeah, zero drop frames. I think we'll we'll leave it the way it is. I think it's just fuck, I pressed the wrong button. Lock FPS to sixty, okay. Oh jeez. FPS V sync on. What is this? That's cool. Okay. Right. The menu intuitive wise is um a little bit fucky. Follow the road, so back the way I came. Oh, we got some colliders. The road looks really nice. The graphics are fucking incredible, as you'd imagine. As expected, Mel's the level looks fucking gorgeous. Really, really nice. Are we going right here, or I, I guess follow the road? It means this way, right? The fucking car is really struggling. It's really struggling, man. <laughs> oh my word. Hey, Marcus. Press B when you are stuck. Okay, cool. We do have an unstucking. The witch, the wheels. It's so smooth. I don't know about that. <laughs> I can't turn, man. <laughs> Put the gra the options in for fun. Squinting at the front. Sorry, I'm I'm struggling to read chat at the same time as this. Change the wheels to the Akash wheels. Oh my word! What the fuck? Akash, vanilla D, yeah. I'm I'm going that way, by the way. I'm steering right. I don't know what, what the deal is. Flatbed chassis. What? Tiger. Is there something I need to, to choose here, Manadano, in order to be able to... In order to be able to play the game, you need a chassis and an engine, and you're done. You might want an S wheel too. Well, I've gone through and already pressed all the D's, but okay. I went onto the map. We can fix that, right? All right, do we need a chassis? Yeah, we need a, we'll go pickup. We'll go Akash Vanilla S, 17. Why can we choose like different wheels for each one? Is that like the, the sum assembly required stuff? I don't know what any of these are, punch it. Oh, I think I, I see. I see what the issue is. The the rear wheels are also turning. 
That was going to be the game. Okay. Okay, this one's a lot easier to, to control. I just want to see the level. Like, the level looks fucking gorgeous. It's so hard to do, like, a, like a snow environment. Very difficult. We've done a few snow maps now in Rise of Piracy, and they're a fucking disaster to... To make it look good. <laughs> um, also did that as well, yeah. Uh, this one, this this is a lot better. This should be the default car. I'm just saying. Car scavenging adventure, okay. It took a whole week to get a drivable car. Oh my god. I've lost the road. Oh, there it is. If we go upside down, what was it? B to go back up? Okay, yeah, B. <laughs> it feels like it's in this massive, massive world, which is nice. How'd you come back, B? B for unstuck. Oh my god. A few collider issues. But you'll have that. Now go off road, okay. Eh. Okay. Can we go anywhere? The music's really good, yeah. Great work, Sammy. B for bring back. B for bun stuck. Holy shit. So there's an ocean out there. I'm guessing that's like a map boundary. You can't go everywhere, but you can go around a lot. Cool. Yeah, at this point, I, I just want to have a look around. Is there any other game mechanics other than the driving? If it took a week, I'm, ga I'm gathering it's not going to be... Ooh. Are we river? Just driving debugging wheels. Okay. Can I can I fix the back wheels so that it drives more like a normal car or no? Working Tyndall, oh my word. Oh gosh dear back wheels, okay. Am I gonna go through the map? Yeah, okay. Let's see. Hang on. Continue game. Is the continue and the load game, are they implemented? Oh, there's an there's enemies. What? Give me an Earl. Earl is a big truck, right? Big Russian truck. Vanilla S. Oh gosh, vanilla S. Vanilla D for the back ones, yeah. And whatever engine. Oh, cool. Okay, different. <laughs> what the fuck? What the fuck? Exploding wheels. Lovely. Okay, one more. One more. Reach the end of my patience. <laughs> uh, what did we do before? Tiger. See speed. What? What's this? This car. I want this car, but with the with other wheels. Um, rugged. Vanilla. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. S for the first two. And oh gosh. D for the back two. 
And this guy, big D ice. Oh, okay, it is a speed. Oh no, the back two are still moving. How do I make the back two not move? Oh, I have to go back, do I? I have to go back to the main menu first and then press continue. That doesn't seem to be a working feature either. Don't know how you did it, me neither. And if you don't know, then there's not much chance of me knowing. If you don't load a new chassis, it might not bug, but I don't know. I don't know what that means. The Okosh is four wheel steering wheel. Pick other wheels. Okay, cool. Uh, speed vanilla. Is that going to just give me shit wheels, though? Yeah, this is going to be shit. Oh, wait, no. It's okay. Right, we're going off. We're going off road. The mountains and shit in the background looks fucking gorgeous. Can I go up there? I feel like I can. I feel like there's a whole there's a whole level here that I'd love to go. Looking around, but I can't because the car is fucked. <laughs> how do I how do I find the uh, the enemies again? I want to go see them. Go for large, I like them. I know rightly if I go fucking with anything now, it's gonna just put me underneath the map. How you doing, Arduino? Ah, oh, here we go, we're back again. All right, a pickup, yeah, a pickup. With tiger wheels, yeah. What does the D and the S stand for? Is there any 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 particular thing I can choose that will be like working? Or is it just fucked? D is drive S for steering. Aha. Uh -huh. But Okosh the Okosh ones were were not that way. NPCs are looking tight. Is there like racing or something? Like what's the deal with the NPCs? Oh, we can fuck with them. Eh. Make a fucking need for speed thing. Is that a fucking... Oh, that's a big uh, oil tanker. With some fire. Okay, it's kind of telling us where to go now. Look at this thing in the back. Deadly. You can bump them? <laughs> One time I asked a rival dad who I didn't. Ah, oh, right. Of course. Okay, this is fucked as well. And we're back underground. Okay. It's buggy, but what, what good can we say about it? The idea is pretty cool. There's NPCs, which is pretty cool. The level looks fucking gorgeous. I mean, the, the unit, or sorry, the... Unreal. What's that? Ah, oh, there's like... Okay, alright. There's instructions over here. Hang on. Uh, snow park this way. If stuck, press B. Awesome. Awesome stuff. <laughs> Beauty and buggy. Yeah. Looks so funny. I need to update the TTS chair. You know what to do. Hey, Yubi. How you doing? We're getting snagged on shit, man. Next, getting Jam Mel's gonna make the gameplay, yeah. I mean, I don't know what you guys were doing, but. Or like what roles you had lined out, but. The car is a bit fucked. 
But it was it was a two week jam, so you know, if it took a week to do the car, I can only imagine what it was like. Some upside down cars. Can we bonk them? Well, we can. We bonk them off the edge. It's the germ mode. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you, Mel's. Mel's knows what's up. Mel's knows I suck at fucking video games. The uh, the level looks fucking gorgeous, though. The unrealness of the of the level itself. Let me just code a new physics card from scratch. Fuck that. Fuck that. No, I can only imagine what what doing something like like that is like, especially on ice. Is it like what was the main challenges of the of the car stuff? This this kind of stuff is mad. Where it like bonks and you almost go off the side of the cliff. The music is nice as well. <laughs> Turn mode this away. Can you go over there, Mels? Can you go over to like that part of the map? Like how big is the actual map? It seems like it goes on for fucking ever. Except for that one time we got to an edge. Jesus. You were there, you can go on the mountain. Aha, gotcha. Very nice. Uh, what was the thing that it said? There was a snow party or a snow park? Is that it? I guess I'm coming up to it now. This is journ mode. Six inches of guardrails. Yeah. Oof. It's just very difficult to actually turn. I think that's just because of the ice or whatever. Is it like a physics material thing, man? I don't know. The music is up nice. Thank you, Sammy. Let me pin that. again off you go no not gonna work well that's the end of my patience with it <laughs> finding the roads and following them is the best bet it's too hard to follow the roads yeah yeah I did have that feeling of wanting to go around and have a look because I know you guys put in a lot of effort and uh, yeah, the map itself would be nice to be able to see. Maybe a video. Remember, I had to ask a few people now for a video. There's another town bit with igloos at the top of the mountain. Would I be able to get to it? Maybe a video. My my computer is really struggling as well. Like I can I can feel it like really struggling. How you doing, Claire? What's the crack? <laughs> but yeah, good work. I like the idea. It's a shame about the car, but I mean, like you said, like car physics. Jesus, where would you even start? Especially seeing as I think I seen where you were going with it because the, the wheels themselves were the driving force, not the actual character of the car. Being the driving force, I, I get you. Um, I get where you were going with the theme as well, like that you collect pieces of the car, and uh, that's why there's different like bits and pieces that you can add and remove to it. So that's kind of cool. I like the idea. Um, and yeah, nice, good stuff. Take the helicopter, yeah. Make a car that has four big steering wheels, and you get there, yeah. Different st spawn points with a, ca with a helicopter? Sure, yeah, why not? Fuck it. All right, what's next? Uh, we have Drop Ball from Daniel Kennedy. A.K.A. Danny K. All righty, let's get it. Let's get it, Danny. 
No more cars, hopefully. <laughs> I'm fucking useless at driving games anyway, you know? <laughs> uh, okay. Puzzle pieces. You can drop the ball. Oh my word, it's so loud. Hang on, it's too loud for me. Is it is it loud enough for you guys? Do not press the home button. I just did. It's bugged and you will have to start levels again. Okay, gotcha. How you doing in traffic? My top 10 racing game, there will be a Jern mode. You can assign an AI to control your car. Excellent. That's what we need. That is what we need. My computer can't even run a game made in Unreal, let alone Unreal. So, you know what? Fair play to you. <laughs> Especially jumping into, like, a brand new... Um, engine. That was fucking... Looked really, really nice. Okay. Shit. I didn't... I didn't read that. Okay, let's, let's focus on this one next. Uh, you can drop the ball into the level by click the highlighted button. Damn it. Um, disable during tutorial. Uh, collect stars along the way and drop ball in, in hole to complete the level. Click to continue. Uh, you can press the delete ball button to remove a ball from the level. Where's my music gone? Okay, it's just not doing it. You can press the delete button button. You can use puzzle pieces to assemble the levels, guide your ball into the hole. You can click on the right pieces on the right hand side and we can place within the border. You can rotate your pieces with Q and E. Uh, left click to place, right click to delete, escape to cancel the selection, click to continue. Thank you. Okay. How do I? Aha, uh -huh. okay, cool. All right, next. I get it. I get it. I played something like this very similar. Oh, fuck. Go again. Fuck. I should have, like... No. <laughs> what the fuck? What the fuck, Danny? Eh. All right, let's do this properly. Hang on, hang on, hang on. All right, so it'll bounce there. And then there. Hang on. Holy shit. Danny, does it add force every time it hits something? <laughs> First time using the built-in physics was hard to get a grip of. We've got more physics woes. <laughs> oh my word. Oh my word. Will it ever get in there? <laughs> I don't think so, right? Um... How about that? Do it. Come on! Yes! I don't care that it's only one star. Don't fucking care. <laughs> Physics is why we can't have nice things. True. True, true, true. Okay, that's broken. Why can't I? Okay, can't place any more apparently. Boing. Oh, oh. Danny, why? Why does it increase? Oh my god. Intended. <laughs> we intended that one. It's fine. Where's the music gone? Where's the fucking music? There was music. Hang on. Let me, let me control F5. We're gonna have to fucking play them again, but whatever. Oh my god. 
Control F5, please. Please. I can't control F5. Ah, there we go. It works anyway. Alright, do the thing. Nice. Ooh. Nope. Maybe it'll bounce around and get in there. No, maybe. Back to the start. Oh, this is a good traject. No, never mind. Journ mode. Love it. The music is nice, Danny. Did you make it yourself? Would it be cheap now to redeem Topic Expert on physics? I could explain to you how the, the physics behind this particular this particular game is. Yeah, totes. I'm going to make myself some coffee while this is figuring itself out. See, what's happening here is moon people. Clayman has brought the moon people. And in doing so, has not one, but two moons worth of populace doing this particular type of particular thing. Kind of feels like the DVD logo is true, 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 true. That is your ball. I think in traffic, this time next month, you are going to have a brand new piece of seeing equipment, be it is there a maximum of something? Like, why can't I... Ooh! It works now, okay, whatever. But there you go. Danny, what the fuck? Did you do this on purpose? Is this on purpose? It is, right? It's adding force. Like, there's no way in fuck this is, like... <laughs> Did you test it? Danny. Danny, did you fucking play your own game? Did either of you have <laughs> the last... <laughs> Cheapers, fuck. The music is really good, though. The Spy Springs Live. New telescope? Yeah, could be. I don't even know what I said for that particular topic expert in particular. It maintained... Alright. How the fuck did we get this going? Previously. Is this what you're supposed to do? I can't move these ones. I can delete them though. Ah, there we go. Okay, go. Boing. Big boing, please. It's stuck. It's stuck again here. Fuck. Danny. Can't place two toes. I, I couldn't be further from the hole. I never... I applied the physics... Ah, germ mode. Germ mode is just one again. Applied the physics attributes once and never adjusted it. I like the way you're dancing around the question there. With that particular question, in particular, being, did you test it? Yes, well, I adjusted the physics and then did the, um, I actually went into the engine and then I went around the engine and, and against the engine. Yes, but did you test it? So the adjustments were made at the time of completion of the jam and therefore the completion of the jam was, in retrospect, retroactive. And there was all, listen, there was all the, all of the stuff going on with Unity at the time and my brain, I couldn't focus on anything. Ah, oh, jeepers, fuck, sure. Didn't they want to charge us 20 cent? And then I couldn't adjust the physicses. Yes, but did you, did you test? Did you play through it one time? How did you actually develop this without, without the, um, like, is it different in the editor? Maybe that's the problem. It's recursive applied physics, yeah. 
It's quantum physics, actually. Indeed. Oh. I was pressing space bar there. What about managing expectation? Here we go. Boing. Nice. Okay. Let's put another one here. Trial and error. <laughs> yeah, yeah. He needed not to. The reason they went back on their decision is because of this game being playtested. They were like, there's too much playtesting going on with this particular game in particular, and this particular game, and this particular jam. Working from home today, why does this have a bi-weekly <laughs> meeting that's supposed to be tomorrow? Whoa, Zulu true. Put the first one up a bit. Oh, it's still going, even though I deleted one. We found a, a flaw. Oh. It's complete luck, man. It's complete luck. <laughs> Don't get me wrong, I love it. You've, uh, you've done great with the, um, with the theme as well. So you're assembling the level. But the, the physics are definitely fucked. We can delete them as the game is going. Look. Up. Up a bit now. Yeah. Hang on. I have an idea. Once it starts going crazy, we're grand. You know? But we can't delete this one, though. Turn mode. Activate. I think we've... I think we have an... Ah! Oh. Okay, there's ten levels as well. True, man. Do all the testing in production. True, I'll let you know. You assembly the chaos, yeah. If you retry 87 times, you learn to account for the physics. True, true. Don't bother, you won't get through most of them. <laughs> Thanks, Danny. <laughs> Danny, how many did you get through? Danny, how many? How many did you get through? Give me your give me your high score. <laughs> Mod three, yeah, buddy. Today we're debunking the myth of every action as an equal and opposite. Yes, objects in motion can only be blah blah blah. If there's a velocity and a force and all that jazz, yeah. <laughs> got to six or seven, then rage quit. Yeah. <laughs> uh Daniel. That was brilliant. <laughs> okay, what's next? Resembadiddle by Pabs, guys. Resembadiddle. Let's get it. Let us, let us, and let us get it. Okay. It's like full screen, but not full screen, but kind of full screen. There we go. Okay. Trip time games. A.K. Pabs. Resembadiddle. Okay. Mouse right click and drag between connection nodes to assemble. R click on red nodes to disconnect. I love this one. Okay. Thank you, Danny. Thank you for, for putting in the game. And you only had four days of work. Gotcha, gotcha. It's cool. Like I, I like the idea. You nailed the idea. Um, the gameplay is good. the The only problem, honestly, is the the bug with the physics. Like that's, I think that's the only problem with it. Honestly, the music was good. Um, gameplay would would have been good. Yeah, with with the uh, physics would have been nice. But yeah, hilarious, funny game. Uh, I had a good time laughing my ass off. There you go. I uh, like this one, but was crap at it and couldn't play it properly. Gotcha. 
This is why we jam though, learning. True, 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 true. Um, assemble, travel, grow. Click on parts to activate. You can resemble all 15 parts. Okay. Oh, okay. Stuff is moving. Oh, it's got an attractiveness to it. Magnetisms. This one break. I think it did. What's the objective? Well, I can increase the time scale. Oops. Okay. Okay, yeah. Let's do it. I don't know why they're not going together. Come on, spit it out. Oh, you can move them. But for why? Can I move these? Can I move them in that way? What? 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 What am I supposed to be doing? I can replace stuff. Okay. I guess I want them to s to touch. Right? Okay, chill, chill. Okay. I, do, I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Can these two link up at all? Uh huh. Now you're talking, Foxy. Yes. Yes. No, don't lift that. Okay, now they're all touching. Was that not the objective, no? Uh... <laughs> oh, right, okay. I have to go over there. This one seems to go to the right. No, never mind. It's one of those kind of games that's just meant to frustrate you, I guess. Which, honestly, I'm not a huge fan of. I don't know what I'm doing. Also, there's no music. Let's put on some. Hey, Canars. The black arrow pointing down, yeah. Are you making them move by clicking on them? But I don't know if there's like a pattern supposed to be there for the movement. They all seem to rotate left and it's making me go right, so. Let's see what's down here. More. Okay, they can go to two different spots. I didn't realize that before. How do I make it go to the right, though? You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, if you spam, if you spam, click them. Right click now. Right click doesn't seem to do anything. It's cool. It's trippy. What was it that you liked uh, about it, Clay?
Hey, cutie kitty. How you doing? Supposed to make a giant shape. I think so, yeah. Thank you. We're playing games from the... Yeah, this is just going to end up hurting my hand. Uh, which one is it following? Like, can I move around? No. There was, wow, one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Cool. Uh, 2D physics platform where you're building a robot and moving it through the levels and over obstacles using limited motion. Each of your parts, power of connections, will move you through the level to pick up more parts. Stuck on an object won't move. It's time to reassemble. Okay. I um I think it, it could definitely benefit from more controls. It's kind of it feels like a Benefotti game, honestly. It feels like right. I gotta spam click this one to get this one to move up just a little bit so that I can go over the rest of it and then I can roll to the left. It's just, you know what I mean. Your primitive organism, yeah. My fingers though are not primitive organisms and they get hurt by spam clicking so i'm not going to do much more of this one i'm afraid but yeah it's good it's um definitely good with the theme um looks nice uh gameplay wise too much spamming if i could hold the click button down if i could move the camera left and right and if it made more sense a bit a bit more of a tutorial perhaps a bit more on that on that particular Thingy. but yeah it seems it seems like it would be good another another one where I would need a video I can't uh, I can't spam click too much or my hand will get sore and I ain't doing it sorry but check yeah, great uh, stream earlier cutie guys if you haven't already followed cutie kitty make sure you check her out doing a uh, unity dev notice uh, let me go back to this I'm gonna give this one more go all right Come on. Come on. Okay. Another robot. Okay. I've glitched it out by waiting, I think. Interesting. Can we? Oh, there we go. Okay. I think that was... Uh, what you call it? Wait, we still have all of this money. don't have audio because it is here we go this is probably gonna be much easier this time because we have all of these researches done already and we have enough for another one Um, we have two factories already. <laughs> Reset his buddy? No, that's fine with me. <laughs> that's grand with me, buddy. Don't mind that too much. Scrap spatula, what was it? Mining chassis, okay. If these were divided as well, that would be nice, I think. Does the mining chassis give any uh, bonuses, I wonder? See what else we can get. Green movement. Green stuff goes burr much faster. True. Sharp shooting. High range. Okay, that'd be nice. It's 500. Fucking hell. Five hundred coal. Japers. Fuck. on that one. I think the lads are just kicking ass now. They're OP at this level of the game. 
I think I have one on everything now. Let's get another one of these. And another one of these after as well. Singletons can't be reset. Okay. That's interesting. I have to reassign it, I guess. The builder should look like this. Aha! Uh -huh. Very nice. Love it. Yeah, your UI work has been uh, really nice. Really great work. I feel like I feel like it's broken now to the point where I would have to restart it. I just kind of wanted to have another another quick look at it, honestly. But yeah, very very nice, great game. Um, uh, overall today, all the games we've played so far were really really nice. Let me check the uh, submission page again. So guys, yesterday I was trying to tell you as well, right? There is a way to see all the games that you have and haven't rated. So make sure you hit the haven't rated button and you play all of those and try them out and do your ratings. All right. Wait till level 10. You'll wreck you again with type 2. You're kidding. So even with all of those, like with that serious boost at the start, even with that, it was still going to be um, impossible. Rate people rate. No, I don't do that on stream, Sammy. Um, guys, tomorrow is going to be Arum by Watermelon. Uh, some assembly required by Kilted. It's a free for owl by Marcus, Belint, and Sammy. Uh, or sorry, Clayman. Uh, Hexagon by Creatine Bionicle, Hayden, and Lego Pip. I don't think we know those people, do we? Civilization deck building. All right. And today was Battle Forge, Clockwork, Life, Petrol, Drop, Ball, and Resemble. Very, very nice. Great work, guys. Great stuff. Another enjoyable day of playing through your games. I'll rate them off stream. Uh, today is the best last day to vote. No, tomorrow, well, Friday f during the day, I think. I actually fucked up. I should probably shave a few hours off that so that I can actually work out who is um, top to bottom, uh, like first, second, third for each, you know, category and stuff like that. I should do that before the stream on Friday. Um, I think the, the voting ends just before the stream on Friday, which is bad. I don't want to be doing that kind of work on stream. I, did, I think I made the same mistake last last year, but I'm not sure. Yeah, the scaling wave is 1.3 bots after level 10. They spawn also oh, jeepers. Fuck. Very cool. Great work, Kenny. Great stuff. I know you were having some trouble during the jam with, um, you know, various troubles that you've talked about. And uh, it's impressive to see what you still managed to get out. Well, good on you. That, may, that means if he doesn't rate them, rate today all of them. What? Today is not the last day. No, no, no. Don't don't worry about that. That was a question, not a statement. Uh, Marcus and DJs. Should Defo do that before stream? Yes, like I said. Uh, got a shave on Friday. Maybe. Who knows? No insider information around these parts, Belint. You know that. Uh, as for the words, I'm happy. Good. You should all be happy, honestly, guys. Like, incredible, like that these games were done in some of them as little as three or four days. You know what I mean? Like you don't have a lot of time to make these things. So no matter how much I shit on your games or like, I'm, I'm going to be honest with you. I'm not going to be fucking, I'm not going to blow smoke up your asses. All right. There's no point in that. And I appreciate that kind of, that kind of shit when you guys are testing rise of piracy as well. Like some of you say, listen, this fucking thing is shit. What the fuck is this about? Like improve on this because I really want to use it. Great stuff. All right, this this kind of oh no, everything's fine. Yeah, I played it for five minutes. It's great. Everything's everything's great. You don't want that kind of feedback from your testers, from your players. You don't want that. You want people to shit on you so you can make something better. All right, and uh, to be honest with you, 
Um, I would be very proud of each of those games. All right. So very good work. Um, incredible stuff. Some of you like touching, touching engines for the first time as well. Mind blown what you can do in a brand new engine that you've never used before. Um, mind blown. All right. Really looking forward to the rest of the games tomorrow. That's the last day that I'll be playing them is tomorrow. And uh, um, on either Friday or Saturday, we will do the reward ceremony. All right. It might be Saturday evening because it, it all depends on I've sent a message today. So hopefully I'll be going air afternoon on, on Saturday morning. But I'm not sure. Holy shit. 99.3 Mel's. What the fuck kind of a landing is that? Holy shit. You know what they do on Nerdwino's channel? If you get like a 98 or something plus, you get a free gift sub. So, you know what we're going to do? We're going to give you a gift sub because you shouldn't be using your VIP or you shouldn't be seeing the fucking ads anyway. Fuck you, Twitch. There you go. Uh, when starting the jam, we got some friends to join. That's who they are. Gotcha, gotcha, Bionicle. Thank you. Um, garbage in, garbage out. True. Hacks indeed, one lion. You know, we had a 100. We had a one fucking 100, guys. A 100. Uh, Petro music has been added to the playlist also. Excellent, Sammy. Good stuff. Throw the, throw the link in if you want. Guys, Sammy did the music for two games. Well, one thing about... Right. One thing about um, uh, multi-teaming is, right, we won't have it next year, all right? Don't care what role you're in. It's not going to happen, all right? But uh, Sammy did do music for two games there in this jam, and the, the music turned out really, really good. But we can't have that in the next jam. So it is a new rule. I, I don't know, like... I always kind of just assumed people would know that, but um, we do need to we do need to specify it, obviously. But uh, the the reason being, right, it means that you're not fully committing to one team, and that I think if a programmer or if a level designer was split between two different projects, um, the quality of work in both projects would would slip, right? And what happens if one comes first and one comes last? Could you blame then that person for splitting their attention amongst two different places? So yeah, that's what we're going to do. We're definitely going to add a, a rule for that next year. Um, and yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll talk about it again on Friday or Saturday, whenever the reward ceremony is, all right? Right, so next up is a bit of game dev. And I did a, I did a tutorial yesterday on uh, FMOD. And I got my teeth into it nicely. And I also had a quick look at something in, uh, what you call it? Okay. At something in, um, oh, cheapers, what do you call it? In the, um, the visualizer thing. What the fuck do you call it? The dungeon thing. Fuck. Fuck my life. <laughs> that thing, right? So I figured out one thing in there. I had a look at FMOD. FMOD in the tutorial looks very, very different to what I was looking at. And uh, I will do another, I think another tutorial tonight before we start like getting our teeth into it. I'm fairly certain now that Friday will be a write-off. Uh, or whenever the whenever the results is, that'll be a write off, right? We'll we'll make that go for the full duration of the stream. So we will only have like one or two days, and also probably Sunday. Um, and then when we get back on Monday, we will either do a day or two on FMOD in the side project to experiment, learn some stuff, and get some things like lined up and wired up. Um, I really like the way that it does music pooling and shit like that. So. Um, we're definitely, I don't know why this, okay, yeah, two demo cameras, whatever. So yesterday, what I figured out was, we can, we can shoehorn in 
this stuff very easily and get a floor plan going no problem so to finish up boarding party I'm gonna add a thing where you can load in into one of these randomly selected and um, spawn in the corners so we'll have a four player shoot them up all right so we'll do that now hopefully we'll have it done by the end of the stream and tomorrow we'll work on some hopefully f mod stuff after the games we only have four games to play tomorrow and that'll be the end of it glad to have sammy yeah yeah his work was great don't get me wrong it wasn't a, a rule we had in the in the jam all right so next year we will I'm just saying why, that's all. A lot of FMOD tutorial official ones are for older versions. Uh, the one I watched yesterday was a back-to-back -back of um, implementing a portal thing. And it was really it was really good, actually. But, yeah, very different to what I was looking at. So I, I decided to just watch that and leave it. FMOD is a legend, true. Where did you start experimenting? True. Forgot this shit existed. Yeah, that's that's one of them. And of course, Sammy has a new one for us today. <laughs> I don't know what to make of it. I don't know if I love it or hate it, um, Sammy. <laughs> right, so. This one here will build us a random dungeon. With random layout. Alright. But it always makes sure that there's a pathway to every square. Okay. And the corners will always be free. So we can put in our spawn points in those corners and build the build the dungeon for each player easily, right? So that's what we're gonna do tonight. Okay? So this is scene floor plan. Let's grab a T scene uh, DDOL. And let's get four players jumping in and shooting at each other. Uh, should we respawn them and stuff like that? Should we even bother? Sorry, I wanted to grab where this is and bring in the other stuff. So multiplayer lobby. Come on. There we go. And... Subscene 1, subscene 2. Terrible names, but whatever. And let's put in a subscene 3. Or should we? Yeah, we should. Whoops. Actually, we should have just let that go, shouldn't we? I love fucking drums. The way that they're done like that. Uh, let's put in subscene 3, and this is going to be our PvP scene. Let's actually just uh, rename these real quick. Um, actually, we'll, we'll leave that the way it is, and we'll change this one to PvP. Let's unload everything we're now using. Uh, we are actually using subscene one or no, we're not. We're using subscene two. We already have it. Never mind. So this guy needs uh, this thing. And then we will remove that. Don't save it. Uh, make sure this one here has the environment game object. And we'll add in our spawn points. It is subscene 2, right? No, it's not. Where are they? Actually, the best ones to take would probably be in here. And they're not visible. Start positions. Here we go. Oh, 
Whoops. Let's get rid of that again. And I don't have any icons apparently. The doors do need to be redone. Um, for the extra four players, fuck it. You know what? Just do it. There's one, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, and they're going to be shooting at each other right o right away. Two seventy, I think. Just fix up the rotations. I think for the most part the rotations are fine. This should be here. Okay. And this scene needs to be loaded if the selected game mode is, um, let's get rid of these as well actually. Uh, that that thing in the background is just there to um, stop people from falling through the world if it spawns too early and shit like that. This is at zero, right? Yeah, we're good. So what is a game mode? We don't have that yet. So we have our mission start prefab. And we can change this um, game mode. How would we do this now? Maybe two of them. For the crack. Get rid of all of this shit. I was just toying with the, uh, the lighting and shit like that. Whoops. Get rid of the gizmos here so we can click this fella. Uh, we will be bringing in that as well. This works really nicely as a as a fog of war system, so we will use that instead of fog. Yeah. Uh, so this one can be coop, and this one can be PVP. We should also change it so that the, uh, actually, hang on, changing the number, the level seed needs to be a thing as well. Let's uh, grab this, mode begin mission. So we do have a game mode thing. Hey, Pabs, how you doing? One lion, how are you doing? It's, it's in many situations true. Thanks for the lurk, Kilted. Sammy's been going nuts with the uh, with the emojis lately. Many chilling, good stuff. One lion, loved your stream earlier. Always do. Guys, if you haven't already checked out one one lion, absolutely amazing uh, coder.
What? Sorry, I can't hear you over the sound of my epic shortage. It's the bard. I would get that no problem, no problem. I don't know what no problem would be in Japanese, but you're welcome. Yeah. Maybe no. I was summoned by the shirt you were indeed, Bardi. Indeed I am wearing you at this point, technically kind of, when you think about it. Alright, so context type, begin mission. Abort mission. Uh begin PvP. Maybe that's a good one. Oh, that's a good tune. Hikey hikey with a hand wavy movement. There you go. There's my hand wavy. Have a problem or no problem? True, true. How you doing, buddy? Monday and I, more or less. Okay. I could say that, but listen, I'll probably forget it. I've already forgotten it. Forgotten it. You barely speak English. Can't expect me to learn another language. I shoot you well. True, true. I didn't, buddy. It's a crack. I should have my red hat on, but it wouldn't make sense because you've got an orange one. Mm. Right, so begin Mish. Uh, what do we need this for? This is for the... Yeah, okay. Command change level. Yeah, we can we can pass in game mode there. I suppose. So if this is begin PvP... We could do that. Ah! <laughs> you know what the benefit is? I can just entirely turn it off. Yeah, let's do that. Let's put a new thingy in there for that one. Bertie, you right there. <laughs> what the fuck? What the fuck happened? <laughs> I really need to know is please thank you, for your beer, please, and pull over here on the left. True, true. Um, Coop. Okay. Game mode is now a thing. Let's create it as a field first. And uh, let's just copy this because we're going to need it. There we go. And this now needs a new parameter for it. Hmm. Let's do the split here. Rad Dev, how you doing? Good to see you. Great stream earlier. How are things? Call me Henio, how you doing? What's the crack? Oh, I didn't know you could do that. Oh, that's so handy. Uh, change scene to seed. Game mode mode. Why is it complaining? Inconsistent. Con oh, okay. Public. Good stuff, I read Dev. What were you working on? I was glad to catch your stream earlier.
Um, I'm just adding a quick PvP mode to, uh, what do you call it? This stuff. <laughs> what do you call it? Um, boarding party, the side project I was doing. We just got done with a bunch of Jern uh, Jam stuff. Tower defense to RTS, yeah. If you wanna, if you wanna share any anything like uh, clips or um, screenshots or anything like that, please feel free to throw it in the chat. We can check it out. Here's a clip. Oh my, oh my word. Godot, okay. Very cool. Very cool. To say last were you using Unity earlier, were you? Maybe not. <laughs> Still in the map generation setup after three weeks of work. Nice. Don't have anything else. Started three weeks ago. Gotcha, gotcha. Cool beans. Well, if you ever do. Um, to be a teasing co op since the large thing is the background. True, true, buddy. A joke I have told true. Beer, please, and pull here. Yep. Um, for anybody new coming in, my name is John. I usually work on this game. We should be back to this uh, midweek next week at the very latest, but hopefully on Monday. Hopefully we'll have enough on Monday that we don't need to do anything else. Sorry, let me just close that. Uh, so this is my game. It's got Rise of Piracy. Uh, it's been in development for about four years, maybe a bit over that. Um, it is on its third iteration, and we recently got a publisher, um, so I can work on it now full time. I try and stream every night, eight o'clock GMT. It's all made in Unity, um, unfortunately. No, nah, I'm kidding. But uh, yeah, it's it's a uh, kind of like Mountain Blade, but with pirate ships. You know, travel around a campaign map, gathering a fleet and gathering crews, and then you can invade islands, take them over, and continue. There you go. Thank you, Birdie. Well, yeah, thanks, thanks a million again for the raid, I read. Really appreciate it. I hope your your stream was good crack. Oh, jeepers, fuck. Okay. I don't actually know what that was. Probably a fork or something. But there you go. Everything you'd ever want to know about the game is here on the Steam page. You can check out some GIFs and uh, some old stuff there. Um, for example, all of these characters are now not senti anymore. Uh, our ships are getting upgraded all the time as well. We've got some really exciting news coming up on that as well. What the fuck? Okay, whatever. But uh, yeah, there you go. And currently we're working on a side project. All right. Uh... Sorry for the super good. Devs can show the process of creating a game. Yes. Uh, gravity still works. Thanks for checking. Excellent. Major steel in the spice. That's what it is. Yeah. More than likely. It snuck in. Um, right. So let me recolor this uh, to like red or something. All right. Now let me get the music going again. Uh, let's just change the albedo a little bit. Perfect. And this one's going to be begin PvP. And the mode here. Uh, mode. Begin mission. In PvP. Okay, that's good. Uh, and the display text. Where are you updated? Jump to if mode is PvP. Uh, actually, yeah, let's do it this way. Equals nothing else rather than a return. Uh, begin PvP. Uh, let's just say begin co-op. I don't know. Bit, bit of roleplay shit is good sometimes. Better game than Badger Party? I don't think so. What do you think, Alishino? 
You know, Badger Party gets quite a bit of um, traffic. It's mad. Um, and when it does, uh, the thing I like about Badger Party is, right, it's sitting there for years. And usually it'll get a download or two every now and again. But you always notice, like, after a few days, you'll see that it's downloaded, like, by, you know, one of the days it was eight, eight downloads in one day. So it's probably people coming along, trying it out, going, oh, this is co-op. Let's um, let's get a few people together for it. And then they go in together, which is kind of fun, I think. Kind of cool. I like it. All right, this is co-op. Let's change the text on it. There we go. Save. And now what do we have next? We have... Uh... The seed here is being changed by something. Update seed. Wait, is this ever called? Find any object by type update seed. Command update seed. For each var. Wait, let's just spin this out. Uh, STH in find all objects what was that find any I don't think I've I've used that before STH update save that should do it for everybody on the server uh, we should also get rid of all these we know that they're kind of not necessary. At least I hope they're not. If they are, we'll figure it out someday. Um... I'm using Fizzy Bardy. Fizzy Bardy. Uh, Steamworks wrapper. <laughs> true, Alishino, true. Hello, Proton Fig. Yes, I, I beat it on the hardest difficulty, Proton. Slayed it on the hardest difficulty, Proton. So I did. Now we need this now as well, and we need change to mission scene. You know, change to mission scene is basically exactly what we want before the other thing. But slower. I thought we had this all sorted out. Maybe not. It was giving us awful trouble, the doors. Lobby is fine. Uh, blast through, we're not using anymore. Let's put these up top. It's exactly the same. We will change this this way. Yeah, let's get rid of that. I was kind of thinking about it before. This is like the third time I've changed this one little piece of code.
Fire message equals. Mode is co-op, then that else. Prepare for battle PvP. And we'll actually make that all red. for PPP battle, let's say. Heathen! Barty. Barty, I have all of heathen stuff. I used I used fizzy. That's all I'll say. Uh, transition started. Okay, mode. Oh wait, no, mode is fine. So it goes to the transition scene for a couple of seconds, and then it loads. Like scene name, otherwise. EVP in name. Can answer that in a DM probably. But I don't think you should need to ask. Did Captain change the slash card picture? Black curly hair with a top hat. I don't think so, Proton. I think it was um, a knight. I don't know what slash is, to be honest with you. Yes, let's give a shout out to Proton Fig. Proton Fig does amazing uh, music and um, assembly and stuff like that. Very, very cool. Do check him out. Okay, I'm fairly confident that this is just going to work. But, so let's just build it out straight away. There you go. Irish chip poop flag, Birdie. That's nice, Nerdwino. Thank you. Yes, thank you, Birdie. Where's the reverse rhino? Did you ever see the reverse rhino? Enjoy. Both. What the fuck what? What do you mean? <laughs> Same. <laughs> hey man, you wanted an honest... An honest... Uh, <laughs> review, didn't you? 
There you go. There you go. How you doing, Dire Prism? Good to see you, buddy. Just one more, one more scene and it doubled the amount of time. Didn't want the reverse rhino. Well, you didn't know that until you seen it. And now that you know, now you know. Reverse rhino sound NSFW. Yeah, don't don't look at the reverse rhino. Listen, you you, sh you should know better. All right, get in there. Do the thing. Prepare for PVP. Pew pew pew. Ah, bollocks. Bollocks. Okay, it was working though. But we don't have this in the uh, build settings. There we go. Now it would have worked. So we can just keep going with it. But we'll need to test. Oh, hang on a minute. This is going to be a balls. No, it won't. It'll be fine. Yeah, it'll be fine. Will it though? Yeah, won't it? No, it'll be fucked. No, it it will be fine. Can I can I mm, let me let me do something with a ragdoll here real quick. Empty scene. Ah fuck, I shouldn't have done that. We should probably make a open set thing. God, I'd love to make another fucking asset for this kind of shit so that I could just bring it in myself. Uh, right, so uh, let's bring in a player. I need to activate a ragdoll on it. Uh, T prefab player. And this guy now needs a ragdoll. A deactivated ragdoll. Add 3D object, ragdoll, dot, dot, dot. Pelvis has not been assigned yet. Okay. Hips. Left hips. Left hips. What? Upper leg L. Upper leg or Left knee. Oh, I regret it already. Lower leg. Ankle. Ball. Picked up the pieces from the jam that I wanted to keep and play around with it a bit. Nice. You should put in some, uh, so that we don't, like, miss it all, but you should put in some, um, updates on the Discord. If you haven't already... Oh, that's left foot, sorry. Right hips, right knee. Right foot. Left arm. Fuck you. Fucking shit. Why isn't this automatic? Come on. Come on to fuck. Complete, total bastard. Aw, oh, I thought we could turn off the eyebrows. That's mad, isn't it? Why are they separate on a Sinti model? <laughs> Must be so that some rigs can automatically pick it up. Um, Bardi, by the way, I do have other Rhino stuff. I know you're probably, like, looking it up now and, you know, all that kind of crack. But I do have other, other stuff in case you ever needed it. Yeah, right? Just reach out. Reach out anytime. I get you, uh... Wait, left arm. Would that be the clavicle? Starting here. Left elbow, yeah. You'd think it would be, right? No, maybe shoulder. Let's do shoulder then. Because the next thing it wants is the elbow. Middle spine. Okay, spine three apparently is the middle spine. 
Head. Total mass, 20. Strength, 0. Make sure your character's in a T-pose. Make sure the blue axis faces the same direction the character is looking. It's not. It's not in the same axis the character is looking, you bastard. Okay, that is. What, what do you mean by the blue axis? Uh, whatever, whatever, whatever. Just do it. Where did it put our ragdoll now? Underneath. See if he falls over. The animator is going to take precedence, don't know. Yeah, fucker. Yep. Let's put a ground underneath him. Plane. And collapse into pieces. Please. Where are you headed? Oh yeah? Heading off? Good. Where where is the tree or the is this it? So it just added a rigid body to everything. Is that what it's doing? Okay. Maybe with the animator off, it'll fall over. Yes, there we go. Interesting. Where's his middle spine gone? <laughs> Runs away. <laughs> Good stuff, Freddy. Very strange that it's going off like that. I suppose it's got to do with the camera. Are we good to... Oh Jesus, it's added a load of shit. Okay, I'm gonna do a ch quick check-in and then we're gonna test it. Good night, Sammy. Take it easy, buddy. Added a load of shit. I mean, it subtracted quite a bit of shit, I, I would think. No? Uh, good night, Sammy. <laughs> Cheers for hanging out, buddy. Uh, what is this again? 20? 21? Ish. Party, would you not say that the reverse rhino has reversed quite a bit of shit? Like, subtracted. Hmm? Okay, let's go back to DDL. Uh, 
And let's put in a debug button for the player controller. How you doing, Anders? Anders, you never, you never, I never asked, did I? No, you didn't. <laughs> I was about to say you never responded to my message, but I didn't send the message in the end. <laughs> I just thought about it. You're not responding to my thoughts, Anders. <laughs> Cannot say it anymore because I closed the DMs with Schrodinger State. Both adding and subtracting. Listen, closing the DM doesn't stop this from happening. <laughs> There's a certain thing that needs to happen, Barty, for that to go away. You haven't done it. <laughs> Man, I don't know. How the feck are you? Hmm? What was that emoji? Hmm? Yes, yeah, right click. Mark is red. Okay. So you didn't see what I wrote then. <laughs> Listen, Barty. Why are you so so sensitive? <laughs> Barty. Uh, we need to make sure that this works across the network as well. So let's say. H. Do I, do I fix the grenade throwing as well? I don't know if I can grenade throw. Unbelievable, Anders. I expect better from you in the future. <laughs> I did say it just because I'm. <laughs> Fuck's sake, Birdie. Fuck's sake. I thought I had the animator in here somewhere. You know what? Let's just do a get component. Anim animator. Animator controller? Is it an animator controller? Runtime animator controller. Enable is false. Enable leak was not enabled. How about that? This should be fun to play around with. Love playing around with ragdolls, man. It's the funnest shit ever. Forgive me, fake. True. True. Does, does a ragdoll have to have all the different things. What happens if I would have given it just one arm bone, uh, the spine, the head, and the legs? None of the ankles or anything like that. Would it still work? Because if that's the case, might be able to make something... Like, because, right, I was playing... Have you ever played... Um... Oh, what do you call it? Sudden Strike 4. Man, what a fucking deadly game. It's actually class, right? I'm kind of addicted. Not really, but kind of addicted. But they have ragdolls on fucking everything. And it's just, you know, five five accesses or whatever. Two scopes now. Scopes. Jason, are you a sniper? Sniper, Jason. You're going to be zeroing some scopes today. Thank you, Astronomy Show. Listen, let me get you a shout out. Guys, if you haven't already followed JavaScript object notation, personified. Um, get over there, drop a follow. Absolutely wonderful. Um, uh, good vibes over there. Forgive me, listen, Anders, I'll try. to fucking sort that out man I left mod shite okay here we go all right here's our play oh no I fell over already hitch fuck bastard I feel like something went wrong there that wasn't necessarily what I wanted to go wrong there you know what I mean Save, start. Thank you, Pabs. I'll try not to forget the eyes and the eye bones, of course, yes. Stopped buying Unity stuff just to start buying Unreal and Blender stuff. GG me, yes. I hope you are planning on developing in Fortnite. <laughs> Fuck. There's colliders all over that damn thing now. Ah, Stop it. 
Nah, it's jank. It's so fucking jank now. And Unity's crashed. Oh no, it hasn't. Ah, <laughs> fuck. God damn it. Didn't see this one coming. Oh, and we're moving by ourselves. Because of the collisions. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Fall over. Fall over. Fall over. No, okay. Why not? Why not, though? Why don't you want to feckin' well feckin' fall over, you feckin' shit of a thing? It must be the runtime animator controller. It has to be, right? And I can't do dot enabled on it. But why? Pabby, Pablo, <laughs> Pabu, Pablo, thank you so much for the, uh, for the gifts of Dallas, you know. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Brave and successful. He's sniping the moon. Yeah, you're not wrong. Trying to be sure. Take it easy, buddy. Thank you so much. Fork knife. Yes. In the same boat. Yeah. Guys, jumping ship because Unity was having a little bit of a moment. Guys. I don't know if I approve of the way a lot of people hype that up. Overhyped garbage is what it was. It was worse than Starship Citizen. That Unity drama. Uh, the kickback effect is really good, actually. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Is that a physical effect? Sure, why not? Uh, for people who hate uh, Unity for charging, Unreal will start charging next year as well. <laughs> Unreal already already take a share. What the fuck? I don't, you know. They already take 5%. Probably not for game devs, but anyway, just wanted to scare you all. You failed miserably. <laughs> they already take a huge amount. They take twice as much as Unity. Um, some Godot expert here that know how to use physics server or Godot just need to create a custom joint with offsets. I think Danny K. Danny K could probably help you with that one, can he? I'm kidding. Unreal also has Fortnite as a source of income. Yep. And you can build your own games now in Fortnite, Fenris Viking. Yeah. Isn't it just mad? The world we're living in. What am I doing again? This player controller is wrong. Is it? No, it shouldn't be. Debug log. Work. Oh. Why did the enabled flag not work? Key code H. Oh my God. Don't look at it. Don't look at it. Don't. Don't look at it. Just trust me, right? The last 20 seconds or so didn't happen. Two minutes, let's say. The last two minutes didn't happen. Did it, did it. <laughs> I need a... I need one of those things to to wipe your memory for the last two minutes. <laughs> Men in black style. <laughs> that was embarrassing. Uh, don't underestimate the power, the social media power of UE fans who they themselves don't even cope. True. I was right. Listen, pabs, pabs. September 19th every year is... Jern was right day, all right? Mark it in your fucking calendar. See that smug emoji that we have now? There you go. Candy Strike, how you doing? A great game like Baldur's Gate 3 with minimum number of bugs, and why can't studios make it, especially Bethesda? I, I'm not sure, Candy Strike, honestly. That's a loaded question. I don't know why so many of those kind of games are a bit fucked. Oh, there we go. Jeez. Jeez Louise. Ugh. Okay, I kind of love this. <laughs> oh, man. Ragdolls are the funnest shit ever. Okay, so we have a capsule collider, do we not? Do we try and get rid of it?
Yeah, we have a capsule collider. So do we get rid of the capsule collider? Or no, we don't because it's needed by the character controller. So instead, we should get rid of all the stuff underneath the rig. So how would that work now? Oh, oh, we need this. We'll take that later. Bethesda wants your money. Larian wants you to make better games. True. I I couldn't figure out your game, Pabs. Honestly, it felt uh, it felt like a what you call it. What was it called? I need a I need a clear video of your game, Pabs. Clayman, did you clear it? Bethesda. <laughs> Didn't Bethesda bring out that Star Stardust game or whatever it's called? Yeah, Starfield. Is Starfield a buggy mess? I thought it was really good, no? Drag from point to point. Yeah, I did that. And then click the parts. So spam click the parts, yeah. Sorry, what was what? Do you have a clear video? Pa or Clayman of um, finishing Pablo's game? It felt like um it felt like a spammy clicking game. I didn't want to ruin my fingers. <laughs> Pabs. Maybe it's for a younger crowd, I'm afraid. So I gave it I gave it a I gave it ten minutes, I think. A couple hours ago. I liked I liked how it was done. I thought it was cool. The way that you could drag stuff between each other. But spam clicking, no. I ain't I ain't playing that kind of stuff. I got to like underneath the starting point and then I left it. I couldn't figure that out either. Could connect things, couldn't move, couldn't so said correct motion, yeah. Was on a meeting, no problem. You can check the bot anyway. Starfield is awesome, but folks complain as folks do, true. Yeah. You can not only control the object, you can make more and more complex bots, yeah. Unreal doesn't charge you yet like they're planning. What are you talking about, Arshino? Arshino needs to do some reading. Talking about subscription style like Photoshop or Maya. They take a fucking market share. Revenue share. That's what it's called, I think. Uh, you can build self-moving machines, true. I thought the game was a really cool concept. I struggled with it, though. Gotcha. Yeah, the concept was cool, yeah. Make a video for us. Yeah, yeah, please do. Gonna evolve on the concept. If we could just get a, a clear video, uh, it would be nice. Okay, what are we doing? Um, everything under here, right? Rigid body and box collider. Rigid body, box collider, and character joint. Rigid body, box collider. Did it do the the joint limits and stuff for me? Hardly, right? Gasp. It fucking did. Oh my god. Incredible. Let's see Gado do that, Yurent, if you're still about. Let's see Gado do that. I'm kidding. Godot probably can do that. <laughs> Jesus. Right. Um, uh, what do we want to do then? We need to get rid of the colliders or we fuck with the camera and ignore the layers underneath itself. It should already do that, surely. No call me shortly. Gooey console. Volumetric fog, we don't care. Orbit can basic. Let's see how this uh, grabs other stuff to avoid. What?
Oh, this is a transform. Okay. No collision offset. Can we check the collisions? Aha. Sphere cast. We could, right? This is big brain, right? But check this out. We could do a sphere cast and give it. Wait, what? What is this doing? Hang on. Ray. That's not a ray. It's a vector. Towards the player. Direction dot magnitude. That's the max distance we want. Origin, radius, direction, hit in full max distance. Jesus. Can we do that thing that we seen earlier? Yeah, we can. Can we do layer mask? And then we do physics, all layers, but we exclude layer mask, name to layer, ignore camera, Ooh. camera collision. Can we do that? Ooh, fuck. I fucked up. Is that not an exclude? No. <laughs> True. True, true, true. All layers exclude unity. No. That is how to do it. Look, I'm doing it right. Oh, hang on. I don't need physics all layers. I just need that. Is that it? So now it'll ignore everything by this, correct? Hello, Toby. How you doing, buddy? Good to see you. Booyah! How you doing? What is the crack? We're almost there with this shit. I should I should do a playthrough now, just to show you where we're at. At a PvP. I don't have, like, hit, hit detection and stuff like that yet. Things are going to play playing with one of this project. There's a way to do it. Very complex physical machines and more feeding. Gotcha. Get a bit up nice. Thank you. Int layer name shit. Yeah. Int layer name shit. 
Is it not one less and lesson? Like this? Bit shifted? Bit shifty? Bit gamey? Shift gamey? Oh, you. Hmm. I think you and the rhino are becoming acquainted quite nicely, Hardy. And to it, hoth, but what it woth of an evening. Hardy, enjoy. Good night. Schlanlat, as they say on the mainland, Schlanlat of an evening. Guys, did you see this? Have I shown you this now? I met Bardi this year. And he gave me that. So think about that now for a second. Alright? Alright, no? Hmm? Save, back, start, work, you fucker of a thing. It actually might be better now than it was. No, it's worse. It's not working. But why is it not worth king? Worth king? Is it because of the bit shift? So I don't need this. Andrews of an evening, though. Do y'all know Bardi? Give Bardi a follow rhino. You all heard it. A rhino. A rhino follow. Okay, it's still not working. Fuck. So that means that the this code is hitting the things that we're telling it not to hit. Right? It's hitting everything. It's hitting it's hitting the the player more so now. Hmm. If hit transform player and is not trigger. Okay, it's doing something inside. I should have fucking read on. This position isn't appropriate. We haven't hit anything. Or we've hit the player. This is an appropriate position. Her person orbit cam basic. Third person orbit cam basic is on the camera, not on the player. How about that? It shouldn't matter, like traversing the hierarchy is supposed to be bad, right? But if it's if it's in that direction, then it should be fine, right? If you're just getting the root. Since you're starting out with a layer mass variable, it's going to see the balance ain't true. Usually prefer to only cast one layer, one or two. This is how you do multi-layer with the bar, right? Bar between them all. Yeah, I do that quite a bit. I'm just trying to avoid its own, its itself, you know? Hmm. 
What is it hitting? It's less than it was. Am I tagged, player? I am. And... So the hit transform route is not player, is what it's saying to me here. So let's do a debug log. Hit. RCH. No, hit. Tag. Transform. Tag. Let's see what it's actually hitting. And also the root. Seems silly. What does the bar? It's a combine. It's bitwise stuff. Avoiding itself as a final boss of game development. <laughs> True. It should be easy enough. Yeah, it's handy enough. Okay, let's have a look. What is it it's doing? Hit untagged, untagged. Untagged, untagged. Okay, well, that's the end of that. I ain't dealing with that bullshit. No thanks. That is simply not true. So that can fuck all the way off. We will do something completely different to get around this particular issue. I ain't, I ain't fucking dealing with it. Like, if if it's gonna fucking blatantly come out here and fucking lie to us, why the fuck would we bother? You know what I mean? Let's cache the animator. Can I get the root bone transform? Is that a thing? Okay, game, just chill out. That's interesting. It used to be here. Let's not care. There's probably an easy way, there's probably a proper way, but this is a side project. I don't fucking care. All right, don't care. A lot of you seem to, well, some of you anyway, seem to need to be reminded of that every now and again. Don't give a flying fuck. Uh, list, using system, collections. Uh, generic for this, I think. Oh, jeez, so much shit. And then, here we go. List of collider. And also a list of joint. And maybe list of rigid body as well. Rag C. Rag J, rag R. Uh, 
And then we're going to get all the colliders. We're going to get all the joints and we're going to get all the rigid bodies. No, I was watching the um, that lad that was doing a he was streaming earlier. What's his name? Hayden is coming to mind, but it's not Hayden. Hadron? Why doesn't it like that? Ah, an array. We can make it an array. Um, I just got some really, really nice stuff in there, actually. Shields and everything. You can fly around and horse about. Okay, so let's go through each for each. Oh, my word. Fingers, please, if you wouldn't mind. Fire. C in rag C. Rag C. Uh, C dot enabled. False. Um... Set all disabled. Set all enabled pulse. Let's do that instead. A nice extension method for the crack. Public void. No, uh, static class. Um, handy extensions. Who gives a fuck? Public static void. Set all enabled this object array objects comma bool value for each bar o in objects o dot enabled sorry it's a unity object enabled Is it not like this? Why? Oh, it's ambiguous. Unity engine equals V. What? Where is enabled then if it's not in object? Component? Seriously? Rigid body is a component. Is a comp is an enable flag here? What's under here? Component to object. It's not in here either. Am I high as fuck? Where where is it like? Anim dot enabled. Behavior. Okay. Happy. Requires a behavior array. Collider doesn't take from behavior. How does that work then? How does it know? Scroll up. Trying to get my jam game done. So much hardwired spaghetti stuff just mashed together. Yeah, buddy. Now you're talking. That's the true that's the true jamming right there, kilted. 
at some point. I didn't care about code quality at all. I'm really wondering why code even works. <laughs> no one should see that code ever, so I feel you. Gotcha. It's, um, we'll just make this bit and it can expand it. Yeah, true, 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 true. Smash it, yeah. You know what? I'm over this. Weird. Very weird. Let's just do this instead. Uh, var. And we'll put these three together. Joint can't be enabled. Is it just the colliders we want to turn off anyway? Fuck it, why not? do that oh I don't have this set where is it root bone transform Oh, we've got an error, that's why. Uh, of course, something here is fucked. There we go. Quick and dirty, yeah. Uh, it's good for prototype and stuff. Like, um, I think everything that, like, you're making a jam should be... Okay, I'm not doing this for real, I'm doing it for a jam, so it's a prototype. And expanding on it later should be like either a full on refactor, start from scratch kind of job, because you did it in two weeks, right? Or it should be, um, you should have it in your mind that you might do that later on. Know what I mean? It's supposed to be fun. Actually, turning it into a, a final kind of a product later on at the end of the day, it might not be possible because you were under so much time pressure to get it going in the first place. No need to let anybody down, I can tell you that. You had never done a jam before, Pabs? What? Striked every day we had, which didn't fit from the plan, only 3%. <laughs> yeah, that's the way it goes. Kin had loads of extra shit planned, and I really wanted to like work on it after the jam, but nobody was down for it. It was a shame, honestly. Put a lot of work into making the code so that we could expand on it later and stuff like that, but never happened. Maybe someday. Good stuff, Babs. 5% of the year. Uh, scoping things is insanely difficult for jamming. Good stuff, Babs. Good fucking shit, guys. Good shit. Onward and upward now. See, next next year... Right, there was some, there was some uh, people who... Did both jams last year and this year and the improvement that they've gone through um is nuts like fucking crazy stuff so you love to see it
so the colliders are gone, but the rigid bodies and the joints are the problem now, I think. Ah, oh, this still isn't working? I thought I fixed that. Whatever. Thanks, uh, Claire, for that, by the way. Driving 900 miles across it? Oh, my word. Am I playing yours tomorrow, Kilted? Okay, I am, right? To supply an old human that builds robots and you supply them with meds. Manage the power of the boss. Find resources, research land. Very cool. Yeah, very cool, Kenny. Great idea. Tomorrow for mine, yeah. Good. Yeah, Kenny, your, your one really does stick out in my mind. Great stuff. I, I have been reviewing them every time after stream, so I only have... Uh, Double check, actually. I think I have very few left. I try to drop a comment on, on each of your submissions as well. Nice. We're up to tw 219 ratings. Very, very cool. So see this button here on the left? Haven't rated. There you go. That's what you want to see. You want to see zero showing up there. Oh, look at this. That's fucking deadly. That's over 50% of the participants have actually rated. Oh, fuck. Yeah, I didn't want to show you that. Sorry. So, yeah. Good stuff. Keep it up. Guys, if you participated in the jam, part of the participation is, is the ratings and playing everybody else's game. If you join just to have your own game up there and not actually participate in the, the thing, then you're kind of missing the point. So, uh, you learn a lot by uh, checking out other people's stuff and rating. Rating is part of it. No challenge, I came up with the bats. Uh -huh. uh, still going through the Simo's game is my favorite. It really jived with my favorite types of game to play. Simo? You mean uh, Clayman? There's only one that I haven't rated and I can be a rat out of my own. Gotcha, gotcha. Every game in the game of the jam is amazing. Yep, yeah, true. Uh, only one open to understand the dice game I play this one. Yeah, I, d I didn't understand that one. I couldn't do that one. Alchemist? Oh, yeah, with the with the circle in the middle that you have to combine things. Yeah, that was cool. All of them were deadly, man. I couldn't be fucking happier with all that shit. It's just class. Can I... Go through each of the ragdolls then and turn them off for rigid bodies, sorry.
Okay, let's try that. Save all. Dice is in run around. Yeah, I gotcha. I know the one you're talking about now. I couldn't understand that at all. It was cool though. Like, I can see where where the idea came from and stuff like that. What the fuck is going on, man? H button isn't working either. You went back over a candy, nice. Title song for Resemble was the first song I ever made, nice. Excellent, good stuff. What the fuck? So what is it we want to do? We want to say... Okay, you're dead, so you don't have... You don't have your animator anymore. Which enables the ragdoll. Does the ragdoll even need these colliders and joints? It probably needs the joints. Why didn't the animator turn back on there? H and G. I was pressing H and G. Let's go again. False. Yeah, it seems right. Like H, G. Man. Oh, I think I know what's wrong. It's detecting from the rear cast on the weapon itself. I don't know where the character's flying after though. Let's try and find him.
Off to Narnia. This is where he is. Interesting. Turn that on, this kinematic. Ignore camera collision. Let's use this layer in the um, weapon controller. I'll do a compare tag on that. Will it get the root? It won't, right? So I should do root. It's a jam and a jam, true. If I started doing this, Tinder was doing epic jam team play. What what happened about that? Actually, don't tell me. Um, I am inviting you all as well at the end. You can come on and talk about your games and stuff. Um, I was restricting that to just the winners, but whatever whatever way you want to do it, just DM me. When you fill your first dice, you have to be rolled, and then let us decide everything you put on one, etc. Uh huh. Now you may want to do go to Clayman's vids, past peak with the countdown party that we were having at Clayman's channel. No idea what that's about. Uh, later you can change the numbers and increase the numbers that you have control what happens. Aha! Uh -huh. Epic MLG game devs plays, okay? Uh, you get more dice as more slots, gotcha. It's like you assign the number effect probability, yeah. In six sides and you roll a one. Aha. Uh -huh. Gotcha, gotcha, Kenny. I was trying to make it so that, like, dice one would have a certain ability, dice two would have a certain ability, but it was just stuck with, like, blanks everywhere. It was a bit strange. Spawn rate of the eyes, gotcha. Six over the head of the HP. Uh huh. Yeah, I, I didn't get the I didn't get that game at all. Fuck yeah, why? Gotta be the aiming stuff. Has to be. Floor layer. Hit transform root compare tag. This is gonna be another one of those fucking untagged, untagged things. Which isn't gonna make sense. There's no other way of doing it, is there? No, there is the origin of the camera. Screen point to ray, screen width, screen height. Point to origin. Player to mouse. Floor. 
I think those comments are old. Do we revert it now? That shit doesn't work anyway. Let's revert it. What did we do? We have a change on the orbit camera. We have that compare tag. We have a few changes on the prefab. We have a bunch of new variables on the player controller. DDOL has changed apparently. And the tags. Okay, what I'm going to do is... What's changed in DDOL? I don't think we changed anything here. I mean, it's got an asterisk on it, so it's probably just a network manager being funky. I'm going to revert everything to the previous commit. And then I'm going to run to the jacks. I will be right back. All right, I'm back. Welcome in, Shark. Tune. How you doing, Belint? Oh, you were using the UI toolkit, Kenny. You didn't like it, no? I like the new input system, honestly. I think it's great. What's the input system like in uh, Godot? Is it good? Arr, oh, Jesus. Guys, is this just going to turn into you guys shitting on Unity, yeah? Boring. How you doing, WooDev? Dev? 
Almost back to 20k, nice. Who's shitting on Unity? I mean, <laughs> read, read what, the, what the guys are saying. It's boring me as fuck. It's boring, it's boring, it's boring. I'm not getting involved anyway. Right, so. Guys, Unity is and will be for the for the foreseeable future one of the top two, even three, um, depending on what you want to make. It, it's it's amazing all it does for you, all right? And look at, you all made fucking games in two weeks, all right? There was a lot of fucking amazing games made in all engines, okay? I'm fucking shit on engines. There's no point. Stupid. The only difference between the engines is who's fucking using them. Alright? Is there smarter than that? Fuck's sake. Fucking gob shittery. Get me started. Fucking rile me up. Only difference is you. Where's my cursor? Okay. It's back. Alright, let's make sure we're back to a place where we can actually aim our fucking gun. I said you're no you. You didn't annoy me. Can he? Jesus fuck. There we go. We can aim again. You know how hard it is to annoy Jern at this point? You haven't been here long enough if you think I'm annoyed by something so small and silly. I don't give a shit. It might sound like I'm annoyed sometimes, but I'm actually having the best time. Okay, let's get our PvP going. P V P Prepare for PvP battle 97. We can actually say send that uh, way higher. Ooh. Ooh, it's not working at all. <laughs> Something strange going on here. It's very boring. Engine wars always are, but no, you're not pissing me off at all. Won't you worry? In fairness to me now, it does take me a lot to get pissed off. Don't it? This isn't paused. Why is it frozen? Ooh. Uh, I can't actually read that. Bus not found, okay. That's all fine. Built level 97. What number are you on? 97. And yet the colliders seem to be a bit fucked. And there's a door here. An open one. Just the colliders, though. Miss Cozy. So can we go around this, then? On the right? No. Can we go through it? We can. Interesting. What way has it broken at all? I need to see all the colliders. Oh, interesting. It's disconnected some colliders from this particular wall in particular. SM build wall 01. It has a collider. It's a completely different seed. The colliders from a completely different seed are there. This is 97, right?
All right, let me just take a picture of this. Kill it. Go into PvP scene. Store this screenshot before I overwrite it. Sorry about the flash of white there. Okay, 2506. What was that meant to be? 96? Huh. Oh, manual hallway. Um, I'm not sure what went wrong there. This is static. Let's destroy, save, and go back to DDOL and give it another go. Nice one, Dire Prism. I'll check it out after. It deserves some shit, true, yeah. Now, don't get me wrong. The, the management especially has been complete fucking arseholery. But, um... Still a great engine. Can't deny it. It's awesome. Ask him some years. Godot lacks here a lot. Gotcha, okay. Okay, it seemed to have worked that time, did it? So, yeah, it's worked. So this guy here needs to be replaced. Also, why is it telling me FMOD's bus not found? I mean... Door spawn. Right? And it'll put it exactly where it was. And in... It's door frame 2. So in here, door frame 2 needs to be the door. Yeah, okay. Alright. This should just work, right? Let's give it a go. When do we get the Ch Jern Rant Twitch channel podcast? Never. Fucking hell, I'd listen to a Jern Rant podcast. You don't know what you ask for, guys. You know not what you ask for. How do we make it happen? You somehow manage to free up fucking time because I have literally no fucking time ever nowadays, it seems. Time for fucking nothing. It's crazy. John Pan, how you doing? Trying to win the old pistols. Right. Woo Dev, what the fuck are you doing? What are you talking about? Probably give Unity a try when UI toolkit is done. Shouldn't be a war, it should be tools. Yeah, true. Alright, see you in a bit, kills it. Hmm. When you find time to sleep. I'll sleep when I'm done. 
sleep when I'm done. You can see through the walls and shit. Fuck's sake. Rice with curry or rice cakes with curry? Rice, rice with curry. All day, any day. The rooms are indeed procedural, yeah. It's just PvP mode. I don't have the other stuff yet. So the doors are not getting destroyed. Let's have a look. We had problems with this fucking all the time. So we need to go back to here. Put an awake on this that checks to see if it's been spawned by the server. Ah, nice one, Connie. Take it easy. Enjoy it, Manadano. Fun appetite. See you later, Kenny. Great work on your game. Very, very, very enjoyed it. Very much so. What if we do a thing on start here? No, it's not a good idea. I need I need to uh, I need to change I need two of these I need one to be a placeholder and one to be not a placeholder the placeholder needs to deactivate itself after a certain amount of time that'd do it that would do it
Does need to be a wee, wee bit of time on that, doesn't it? Okay. True, Shark, true. This should just work now. Feels like it's in a weird spot. They are in weird spots. Uh, we got some Z fighting. As long as Brian's not around, we should be okay. I was gonna do I was gonna Google their runtime ragdoll. I had a ragdoll at runtime. Is it worth doing something like that? Let's see what's involved. Don't have a fucking dark team theme on um on Unity. Oh my word. <laughs> Holy shit. This is exactly what we were doing earlier. Oh my word. What are the chances? Joint.enabled is, is true. That's wrong, right? doesn't have it doesn't have that that's so funny um another thing we could do is like duplicate the car the player Mm. That's a video. <laughs> it's just a video. 
video of Ethan falling over. Hmm. Light themes for all of my apps, unbelievable. Surrounded by light theme people, unbelievable. Can't I can't be dealing with that now. Um. Right. Um. We need hit reg on our characters. So that should be easy enough. Let's. Uh, Let's add something to the player controller could do it. Oh, this is door collider, a door controller. Player controller on particle. What? Unbelievable jump on. Un fucking believable. New V, yeah, it is new V, sorry. I'm just trying to think, like, what should we do in the case that they die? We should just, uh, I want to do a ragdoll, but we could just play a, play an animation. That'll automatically sync then. We wouldn't even need a hook. It's better to have a hook though. See if that works. Uh, let's put in a debug log error. Internet's going down, I think. Oh no, we're back. Come on. How am I going to get a particle to hit me? Okay, I need to do this test from inside a build. Could have just dragged one in, but fuck it. I need to get rid of all the other uh, stuff that I'm not using as well from Code Respawn. There's a shit ton of crack in there, and it's 
causing this to be very slow now. Shark, thank you for the prime sub. You know, the other day we were talking about moles. I don't know if you were here for that, but I think we're going to go with that. We're even going to make a super mole leprechaun. And the idea being, this particular one could perhaps, but not limited to, probably like spawn other mole leprechauns that germinate within them. And we haven't done anything like this before. But, um, I don't know, making a sci-fi game, it just feels kind of... It feels kind of, kind of like, yeah, it would be something that we would do, in fact, yeah. So, yeah, that's what we're going to do. It can, of course, um, see through. Fuck. I was just killed before we even started. Okay, sorry, let me go again. But, yeah, that's what I'm thinking of an evening, Jack. So, Jeffrey Bezos and um, John Rosado apparently are going to be in the same um what you call it in the same house someday soon and we have that house well and truly ready to be um pew pew done by you know leprechauns so more leprechauns should be able to get in there nice and easy Okay. It works. We need scores and shit next. We also need to lock the game. Does put the um the doors off to the side. I just spotted it there. Okay, it works, but it's like we we need a bit more obviously to it than just turning off the uh, the prefab. But yeah, that should be good. That should be good. Maybe respawns, scores. Let me let me make note of this. Uh, scores, pathway back to lobby. I think that's good enough then, you know. Uh, I'll do another thing as well tonight. Uh, another tutorial on FMOD. And we'll see where that goes then. All right. Guys, I think that's enough for me. I think I'm a bit too fucked now to continue. Struggled even to come up with a with a leprechaun story for the prime sub. Thank you so so much for again for that shark. Um, I am gonna raid out. Let me see who's about. In fact, I was just talking about this lad earlier. Yeah, this guy's still going. Seven hours. Oh my word. Let's raid over to this guy. It's the same pack, right? Same pack that I'm using. But it's in Unreal. I know. I know. Crazy stuff. To be mad. Yeah. Thanks a million, guys, uh, for hanging out. I'm really looking forward to tomorrow. We're going to be playing through the Thursday. All, all Everything that we're going to be playing is actually on the Discord. Uh, also, if you're new here and you don't know what I usually do, it's not this. It's This is just a side project. I usually work on a game called Rise of Piracy. And um, I actually have some stuff to take care of for that, probably tonight or tomorrow. But we'll see. We'll see what the crack is. But yeah, thanks a million. Tomorrow, we're going to be playing um, some notable ones uh, from the community. We have Clayman, uh, Marcus, Belint, and Tyndall's game. Uh, we have... Am I even going to be able to get to them now? Where's the schedule? 
Here we go. We got Atrium. And we got Kilted Ninja's game. We got uh, Bionicle's game as well. So can't wait for that. Really am ecstatic about with, with all the games so far. The jam has been great. Absolutely fantastic. You guys have really knocked it out of the park. Um, fantastic participation. Make sure to keep going with the ratings. I know we're up over 200 ratings now. So fan-fucking-tastic work on that as well. Thanks a million, guys, for hanging out. See y'all tomorrow. 8 o'clock GMT will be starting. And uh, I don't know. We might have a few pints as well. Oh, wait, no, it's Thursday. See you tomorrow anyway, guys. Good night.